good afternoon YouTube or good evening sorry just wanted to do a quick video before I go away on holiday no tripod or anything today this is just an update on the new shelter this is the spot where I've been um, setting my hammock up with the tarp reviews in between these two trees the last few weeks been working on this pretty much all afternoon and I've got to say I'm pretty knackered now the Laplander has been the star of the day, Barco Laplander and um, also my axe on that last one there, you'll see this was a beast right at the end of the day so I just decided to take the whole stump this is just all oak or mostly oak from um, the oak trees just branches, I'm just layering this up, I'm going to do a big beast of a shelter this time because they smashed the last one down um, yeah, so I'm just done a cross beam there. I've put Y struts in either side here to support that so it doesn't fall down. And then sort of quadruple wrapped it in paracord. Another Y strut oak. It's all dead, but it's solid stuff. The oak you can see. If this decides to focus. But yeah, the Laplander has got through all these last one I had to do the axe on Laplander's sword through all of these today no problem then I'm putting another beam or I've put another beam across here that's gonna have verticals going down as well then probably gonna go across here and have from that tree to that tree so it'll be like a triangle type setup with a massive fire pit in the middle and an entrance somewhere and then I'll rely on the tarp to keep the rain off but I probably will cover all this with leaf litter as well to waterproof it like that got some nice chunky logs on this a beast to cut down another Y beam there, I can sit on this so it's solid here we've got a nice angle under there can be able to sleep under there if need be happily hammock there, hammock there bivy bag on the floor, whatever probably a couple of my mates out here in this one, they keep asking they can come and sleep in my shelters, so probably fit in this one nicely when it's done. But this is going to be a whole summer project. This is not a survival shelter. You would burn far too many calories doing this. I've been sawing down these dead beasts coming off of the oak, off the huge oak trees. So the Laplander's getting through these, and then it's falling down, cutting it to length. You can see the ones. Here. and they were going all the way up there I mean I've got a thing called a sabre saw at home a reciprocating saw that you could bring out of a couple of batteries if you wanted to get this done a lot quicker but where's the satisfaction that it's all about satisfaction isn't it this building something and then being able to look at it when it's finished at the end and having satisfaction That's the whole point but yeah, I think this is going to be a beast of a shelter when it's done. Obviously, because it, it looks a lot bigger than what I thought, because I just had my hammock there, but the fire heat will probably get lost circulating around this, but it just stops the wind getting in and anything else. I just like having the walls. So yeah, this is the first part of this shelter, which is probably going to go on all through the summer, hopefully. Lots more dead standing to chop down make this wall up make this wall up fire pit and I'm knackered now so I'm going home um, yeah thanks for watching thanks for all my new subscribers as well much appreciated to all of you and I'll return the favor whenever you've got videos and stuff subscribe to you um, yeah that's it for now expect some updates from the jungle thanks for watching